SME Market Hub. Buy, sell, list, connect. Welcome to another episode of Dishing Out with Ndani. My name is Chef Eros. Eros is the god of love and my love is food. On this episode, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a braised oxtail that's been slow cooked in red wine sauce. And we're going to serve this along with some mashed yam. Yes, I said mashed yam. To do this, I have my good friend, the famous and the also witty Bizzle or Shikoya. <laughs> Hello! How are you? How are you? What's good? Man? I see you come bearing gifts. Of course, of course. I have to bring gifts. Black pepper oh, wow. crusher. Thanks. Thanks. Um, Thanks. My snapback. Oh, wow. She wears so Oh, this can, is nice. Ah, it's even match A. Hey. 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 You know, like we planned this. Sure, we can just carry on with this. Of course, of course, of course. Okay, the show can continue? Of course. Okay, so today we're actually making mashed yam. Have you ever had mashed yam before? <laughs> But you have mashed potatoes. Potato. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Same thing. Yeah. We're trying to, you know me, I'm very Ninja. Yeah. So um, we're going to put it all with all these herbs and spices, you know, uh, slow cook it with some red wine for about an hour or so. It's about two hours there about. It'll be well, ready. Let's cook first because I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. All right. So let's start. Let's, let's start. Let's start. And now I'm just going to spice it up. So I'm using some stock cubes first, for starters. So two stock cubes goes in there. And then some black pepper, some other crushed peppers. So much pepper. Some dried basil leaf. These are fennel seeds. They have a very aromatic flavor. So I'm just going to add a pinch of that. And this is cardamom as well. I thought that was very much. <laughs> Garlic and peppers. Alright, so pinch of salt. That one. That one. Uh, Paprika. Paprika. Yeah. Give it a good, like, just a little sprinkle of olive oil, just it right there, like that. And then with my hands, I'm gonna work this all through. Okay. First, you cling film and pop it in the fridge for half an hour. So while that's marinating away, we're gonna start chopping all our vegetables. Now, you wanna finish peeling your yam. So, when you're basically braising, um, you want to bring in as much fresh herbs and vegetables as possible. So I'm using celery stalks here. So I'm taking away all of the leaves from the celery and just using the actual stalks. Okay, so now we're about to start. Pan is hot. Tablespoon of oil just to coat the base of the pan. Tongs. I'm missing one very key item. What? Garlic. So, two cloves of garlic. One clove goes into the pot and the other clove goes into the stock. Quickly, garlic goes in there. And all we're trying to do here is let the garlic infuse into the oil. Okay? And then as that's infusing away, you're basically going to start with the oxtail. So, one at a time, oxtail goes in. So the moment you put it in, in about a minute, you would start seeing it look like this. As you guys can see, look like this. So all the spices are already sealing into it. All right. So what you want to do is flip them around to the other side. So the spices seal into all the sides of your oxtail. So now as you can see, the ox oxtail is sealing on, on two sides. We just want to seal it on the other two sides. So everything has four sides, right? Mm -hmm. This is nicely infused, all right? It's sealed rather. And now the next thing to do is to pour one cup of wine into all of this. And I'll bring the glasses on the side as well. So. And the moment the cup of wine goes in, Wow. You cover it and just let that. So do we let do we start boiling the yam now? No, not yet. Not yet. 
Now what's happening is the wine is taking all those juices that has sealed and all those flavors that has sealed and it's combining everything together and basically evaporating all the alcohol from there and it's just everything is binding. We're going to drop down the temperature to low heat, all right? Low heat temperature now. One cup, actually two cups of water. Is this cooking cup? Yeah, this is a cooking cup. So this is a half cup of water now. This is a half cup rather. So I put, that's one cup now. So and two cooking two cups, cups of water. water. Okay. Then you put in the... And then... All carrots. of this. The carrots, the onions. onions. Notice the... Um, oh, the Scotch bonnets, the uh, Atta um, Rodo. What do they call it in English? Scotch bonnets. Scotch right? bonnet. Now nah, I know. The Atta Rodo, I call it. The Atta Rodo has just been cut into two. Thanks, All right, that's Aros. because I want to take it out afterwards. I just want the flavors from the Atta Rodo. Thanks, so that's Aros, going in as well. for telling me the English name of... Yeah, welcome, Aros. sir. The celery stalks. Yeah, celery, I know that. And Some the ginger. Ginger, ginger. Yeah. oh, ginger. <laughs> ah. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, so... Salt, salt, the crushed garlic and peppers, pepper. just some more of the fennel seeds, not too much of that, that's very strong flavor. No paprika. Okay, paprika goes in too. So just a few of the red ridges. I love ridges. In there. Okay, some dried basil. And you brought me these. And yes. I'm so glad you did because I'm pretty sure. I just knew that you need it because <laughs> I don't know any chef that doesn't. Please tell me, yes. Whole peppercorns. All right, so I'm going to put in some whole peppercorns, about one teaspoon of whole peppercorns. All right, so you want about three dry bay leaves in there. Finally, oh, smells half so a cup good. of smells so good. I wish you guys could red just wine. Smell yeah. this food. I'm full already, sis. I don't think I'll eat. <laughs> if I hear, say I don't talk. <laughs> oh, I remember what's wrong. Cardamom. I haven't put the cardamom seeds in. So. I'm sure after this, a lot of people say I like food. Man, I don't care. Everybody likes food. <laughs> Me, I like food too. Everybody I likes food. Talking about. All the people that pretend like you don't like food, they actually do like food. But and if you don't like food, you will not eat. And you will starve to death and I'm die. Telling you. Okay, so the yam is boiled now. I put the heat off. So yeah. I just want to take this out. Um, so take the yam out cut it up in small pieces, and we turn it back into the cooker, into the pot, and we're going to mash the yam with some butter. So I'm going to grab the butter and the whipping cream from the fridge. Okay, I'm going to do a real quick stir fry to go with this. Coconut oil, just a bit there. Onions goes in pan. Let that caramelize a little, and then the peppers. And this is oyster sauce. Okay, let's make that two teaspoons of oyster sauce then. Pinch of salt. Some crushed black pepper. I knew this would be very useful when I bought this. I'm ready. Oh, I cannot wait. I see you went straight for the oxtail. Mm. I know what the mash hunt is like. <laughs> yeah, clearly. You're My hat says it's oxtail. This is amazing. I wish people could just taste this thing, please. Definitely. Ladies, Definitely. just employ Chef Eris and I. Yeah, we'll, we'll do a fantastic job. Clearly. Trust me. Clearly. We'll cook for you. Mm. Invite all your lady friends. Oh, wow. We'll cook for you guys. This is really good. Shout out to all the crew. God bless you guys. It's a shame the crew self cannot taste out of this food. <laughs> oh my god. This food is amazing. I'm taking some home, sis. I'll eat it tomorrow. 
<laughs> this is free restaurant food that I did not pay for. <laughs> Nani right. TV, God bless you. God bless him, Danny. All right, guys, there you have it. That's our braised oxtail and red wine sauce and mashed yam. You can do it yourself at home. Remember to take a picture and post it on Instagram at Andani TV and at Chef Eric. You can add me too. Add Bizzle as well. And George the food if you Let us know how it went. This is Dishing Out. My name is Chef Eros. See you next time. God bless you guys. We love you. Hi, I'm Onos. And if you did enjoy that video, which I know you did, you better subscribe to our channel and you can watch more videos too.